Hello everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to perform your insert operation on entity data model that is in your entity framework. It is very simple. Say I have a form, it is a normal ASP.NET form that I have created to insert data into the department table. As we know that department ID is auto-generated column. I need not to do anything for this column. The values get automatically for this. Next, department name, I have created a text box for that. For HOD, I have a text box. For gender, I have a radio button list. And for active flag, I have is active checkbox. Now, on this save button click, I need this data to get inserted into the department table. So I'll double click this button and I'm going to write code here. As I told you in my earlier video, if you want to perform anything on entity data model, you need to use a namespace that is nothing but using organization model that we have in our solution explorer in organization model that is this this is the namespace that we have organization model so I'll say organization model and I'll create an object of this class that is organization entities organization entities OE equals new organization entities now I want to perform an insert operation on department table that means I need to create the object for TVL department this is the entity that we got for department table so I'll say TVL department D equals to new tbl department and i'll say d dot department id is auto increment i need not to do anything for this department name i'll get it from txt department name dot text dot to string i said d dot hod name that is hod equals to txt hod dot text dot to string so all this txt d name txt hod these are all the ids of the text boxes that we have on the form d dot gender equals to i have a radio button list that is rd rbl gender dot selected value dot to string and I have D dot active this is of type boolean so I'll say is equals to whenever the checkbox is checked I should set it to true when the checkbox is unchecked, I should set it to false. So how do I do that? So I need to check whether the checkbox is checked or not. So I'll say C K B active dot checked. If this is true then I'll assign true else I'll assign false I can write this ternary operator or I can simply say this ckb active dot checked checked will return boolean and it acts as boolean if it is checked it will set to true if it is unchecked it will set it to false now my object is ready department object is ready i have created it with the help of this entity or you can say object now i need to insert this department d in the department table so i will perform that operation with the help of organization entities object so i'll say oe dot 
add to department and see that it is asking an object of tbl department that is d and finally i'll say oe dot safe changes it is going to reflect the things back to the database that's it this is very simple this is how you can perform an insert operation now let me right click on the department table and say show table data currently we have two department that is qa and admin i am going to add a department called as development as a department name as development hod as long gender and i'll say is active to save this let me look into the database right click at the top 200 rows i should get developed so that's it this is very simple this is how you can perform insert operations with the help of entity framework thank you very much